Welcome guys, welcome back to the next episode of Fallout New Vegas. In the last episode, we talked to Easy Pete and Chet. But now, we're gonna talk to Trudy and Sunny Smiles and get the tutorial set in motion. We're gonna deal with the future threat of the Powder Gangers. Okay. Now let's go on the Prospector Saloon. For 24 hours. Hell yeah. The Mojave. Oh. Cheyenne, stay. Cheyenne. Don't worry. She won't bite unless I tell her to. Sunny smiles. I need to get to Prim. Can you suggest a route? Sure can. Route. Take the road southeast out of town till it hits the freeway. Prim is a town with a roller coaster straight south. Can't miss it. NCR patrols do a good job of keeping the highway clear, but I'd keep your gun where you can reach it easily. You never know who you'll run into. Off the road, you'll probably start running into hostile wildlife. My advice would be to stick to the highway when you can. Okay. Uh, what do you do around here? I hunt geckos mostly. The meat's pretty good, and I can always find a buyer for the hides. I also help keep the town clear of rad scorpions and coyotes. Not many people live in Good Springs, so wildlife is always creeping in. Hmm. Um, I'm a little short on caps. I don't suppose there's any work available. Not in Good Springs, no. But if you're up for a little scavenging, there's always the schoolhouse. Most of what's in there is junk, but there's this old safe that Easy Pete wasn't able to crack with dynamite. If you want to take a shot at it, take these. What are the bobby pins used for? You'll need those to pick the lock. Be careful, though. Put too much pressure on them, and they'll snap. And this magazine? Locksmith's Reader? If the lock's too much for you to handle, reading through the magazine might give you the edge you need. Cool. Alright, I'll go take a look at that safe when I have a chance. Always happy to help someone down on their luck. Let's talk about the areas around Good Springs. Sure, what do you want to know? What are the towns are nearby? Southeast of here is Prim, can't miss it. Since it has the giant old roller coaster right in the middle of town. The NCR's got an outpost there. If you follow the road north, you'll eventually hit Sloan and Quarry Junction. They mine rocks or something, but I heard they got troubles lately. I wouldn't head that direction if I were you though. Got critters up there that don't take kindly to getting shot. Hmm. The NCR? The New California Republic. Bunch of settlers and soldiers coming in from the west. Fixing nice. on making Nevada their own. They can be right pushy, but the roads are safer because of them. So, I tend to let it go. Not that I got a choice. Yeah, that's true. What does the NCR keep you safe from? Well, the wildlife for one thing. Rowdy locals for another. They're protecting their own. Just happens to help us. They've been holding off this other group from the east, too. What kind of creatures are out there? Around here, mostly coyotes and geckos. The coyotes are pretty dangerous in large packs, but otherwise they're nothing to really worry about. The geckos aren't too tough, but they've got a nasty bite. I've heard about bigger, nastier versions out in the wasteland, but I've never seen them. Stick to the roads when you can, and steer clear of the hills north of Good Springs. The critters up there are big and poisonous. Okay. That's all I wanted to know. Let's, let's talk about something else. If you want to know anything else, just ask. <laughs> Doc Mitchell said you could teach me to survive in the desert. Yeah, I guess there's a thing or two I could show you. Sounds like you need all the help you can get after what they done to you. Meet me outside, behind the saloon. We go outside. This is the little shooting training. Did you had a shoot? Big corner. Now, see the sarsaparilla bottles on the fence there? Take this and try to hit a couple of them. That's the right idea. Look down the sight. Try crouching down and staying still. It'll help your aim. Listen now. 
Nice shot. Well, that's nice. a start. But I don't reckon you came to me to learn to fight sarsaparilla bottles. Tell you what, I gotta go chase geckos away from our water supply anyway. Darn critters are attracted to it. Why don't you come along? Okay, I'm in. Follow me. It's just down to the southeast of short ways. Cheyenne. A nice hat. They're rubbing at the spot. I hear him. Hear that up on the ridge behind me there? We got some geckos to clear out. Geckos. Bunch of little monsters is what they are. Seems like Doc Mitchell treats more gecko bites than anything else. Let's see if we can get a little closer. If we move quietly, we can get the jump on them. More likely to hit something vital that way. I mean, the geckos in Fallout 2 were super annoying. Especially the golden ones. They're huge in that game too. Okay, you're on. Go give them hell. Oh. Oh. Ooh. So I can use vats, but the sun is my house. See? You're getting the hang of it. There's two more wells that still need clearing. You want, you can come along. It'd be worth a few caps to me. Sure, I'll come with you. Shouldn't take more than a couple minutes, especially with two of us. Come with me. I believe there's actually a lady around here that needs help. She's being attacked by some geckos as well. Yes, vets. Oh. Oh, I didn't do anything. Oh my gosh. Varmint. We're coming, lady. one uh, okay I'm oh she got him teach you to mess with me holy moly if you hadn't come here like you done I'd be a goner for sure I came up here to draw water but here you should have what I got you look thirsty nice we're accepted nope yeah the reputation system Super cool. And the hide as well, so I can sell it. Now that was some good work. Even got a little exciting there at the end. Here's a little spending money for the trouble. One more thing I wanted to show you. Thought I might teach you about living off the land and making useful things for yourself. Interested? Couldn't hurt. All right then. We'll need a couple ingredients to get started. Gonna want some Xander root and a Brock flower. Let me think now. I know I've seen Brock flowers growing up at the graveyard, and I seem to remember there being Xander root over by the schoolhouse. Bring those on back to me, and we'll get cooking. Healing powder. It's with the, uh, the Arroyo village in Fallout 2. One of the uh, leaders there, ritual people, like, made it for you. Cool. And the cool thing is, during this whole quest, intro quest, uh, it's optional. But Cheyenne can die, and that lady that was getting attacked, uh, she could have died as well. But she didn't. Right. We gotta find the ingredients first. Of course. Okay. Xanderu and Brockflower. Yeah, Good Springs, a nice little town. Very simple. 
Just trying to make a living, you know? And the schoolhouse has the... The Brock flower or the, or the Xander root. Ooh, yes! All these magazines are... Uh, all these magazines, like all these mailboxes have the magazines in them. Just heading around. Laser pistol. I love laser piston. Pistols. Hello there. Oh. Poor condition, eh? Hmm. Yes. Bullet time. There's also a cinematic one where, like, you know, it's like you shoot, you shoot, then you kill them, and then like the you follow the bullet. That's pretty cool. That's my favorite, though. Hmm. Oh. Entus. Oh, me. Oh. I swapped my shotgun. I want no mantis egg. Get out of here. Bobby pin. Wrench. Not entirely useful things. Oh, cap. Mmm. Love that sound. Alright, let's go, um... Okay, we can either... Oh. Oh, the game crashed! <laughs> this is the hacking minigame. Like Fallout 3. So we can either do this... Or we could just... Okay! Level 25. Okay, here's the thing. So I'm gonna skip that. And... We can use a locksmith reader. Once she gave me. It boosts a 10 to our lockpick. Can we use it? Boom! We're able to do it. Uh, yes, lockpick, yes. Bam. Jet in there. Right away, Simpack. We'll take it off, yeah. And, uh, yeah, we can't use it, obviously. Cool. Okay. It's good stuff. Did I already grab it? No, I didn't. Then the root. I'm guessing it's just those three bunches. Yeah. And the Brock flower be up there, towards the, at the graves, gravesite. We thought he was shit. He wasn't. We showed him. Alright. I went ahead and gathered some of the like you know, mailboxes. I went around the whole like little town. I looted some bins and some mailboxes and found some you know, magazines, some all kinds of stuff, some little some some duct tape. Oh my gosh, I forgot to buy the Freaking shovel! I to bring the shovel from a uh, jet. It allowed me to, you know, kind of dig, get the loot inside them. You're next. One more. Maybe not. Meet the. The gl snow globe! You find a limited edition Mojave landmark snow globe. These rare pre-war artifacts are widely considered to be useless bubbles. 
But rumor has it, some collectors want to pay dearly for them. Fascinating. Well, that's where we got shot at. But here we are. There's the strip over there, New Vegas. We got tons of locations over there as well. Yeah, Jake's of Town over there. Oh man, it's looking good. Cool. Alright. Alright, I went ahead and went back to Chet to buy that shovel. Now we're able to dig up grave sites in the game. Ooh. With the loot within it. Okay. Be this site right here. Hmm. I'm missing one. Oh, that's, that's so loud. That's this one already. Two LR. I mean, that could have been better, but hey, I'll take it. Then it's Brock Flower. All right, let's go back to Sunny Smiles. Oh, Sunny. I returned. Bye. Let me see what you got. Yeah, these will do just fine. Just fine. All right, now. We're going to be making something folks on the trail call healing powder. Go on over to that campfire now. Give it a try. Okay. Crafting. Healing powder. Ooh. Hey, that's not bad, see? All it takes to make a recipe is the right ingredients and the right know-how. Sometimes it won't be a campfire you need. Might need to do some work on your guns and ammo, maybe. Important thing to get is it's all the same idea. You just need to find the right place to set up shop. Workbench or reloading bench, whatever. Well, I hope that's enough to get you started. I'm heading back now. Hope I didn't miss anything good on the jukebox. Cheyenne would never forgive me. Hey, do me a favor. Trudy, she's the bartender up at the Prospector. Kind of the town mom. She likes to meet newcomers. She'd be cross with me if I didn't ask you to poke your head in and say hi. Okay, we'll do that. Come meet Trudy. Oh, there he is. Hmm. You right there, bud? Hello? Barton Can Thorn. you help me? Uh, what's wrong? My girl is trapped by geckos on the ridge, and I can't get to her. Please, she's going to die. Where is she? Go up the path, past the broken radio tower, and go to the right. They're at the top of the trail. I'll see what I can do. You will? Thank you for helping me. Please hurry. Oh, uh, finish. Thank you up there. Hmm. I'm gonna bring my. Mm, I guess the 10 millimeter would be the quickest way. Oh, goodness. Oh, somehow I hit him. Oh yeah, level two. Speech forty-five. Barter's in a good spot for now. No melee. Sneak level twenty. Survival ten. Yep. Yeah, so let's do that. Oh wow! Rapid reload. That's twenty-five percent faster. That's actually really good. But we'll do we'll just learn. Beautiful. I see the marker. The 
first. Yeah, yeah, I see you. I'm gonna go to the ones in the back. Duh, I got ghosts. Oh, yeah. This shotgun is incredible. Oh, that slow motion effect. I love it. Oh, what the hell? What the shit? What happened here? Disarm, bad shot. You got XP every time we do this. Do nothing. Anymore. It it one. Barrel cactus. Hmm. I'll take it all. I'll take your entire. I'll take your entire stock. Wild wasteland. Okay. Whatever. Oh, I can take the cards, man. Oh, I see. Cool. Wow. Brown. Okay, I'm sleeping. Ah. Uh. A nice morning in the wasteland. Adventure outfit. Okay. Well, uh, reading glasses. Red charmer outfit. What's this? Oh. Plus guns and plus weapons on melee. But the damage resistance is too good for the armored vault suit. At least for now. The lighting in this game is really good. In the morning, at least. But then it gets to tell you, like, a... Really weird brown hue. During the daytime. Turn it back to the sky real quick. That's all that was in the briefcase. Lame. There he is. Oh, yeah. Sorry I tricked you, but thanks for clearing out the geckos. Now I can get to that stash up there after I deal with you. Sure, sure. What's about that, buddy? Off with your head, sir. Button thorn. You've been eliminated. Alright guys, I'll see you guys in the next episode of Fallout New Vegas, where we confront the Powder Gangers and deal with the intruders on Good Springs and get to know Trudy and the rest of the folk around the town. So, I'll see you guys then.